Back to my channel my name is Yulia and uh, today I have a new vlog for you I'm sorry about the lighting I'm hating this lighting but this is the lighting that we have in our hotel room so we're in Colorado we are doing a super fun winter trip right now we're in Durango in the city of Durango we're gonna go to Monument Valley in Arizona then we're gonna go to Telluride we're gonna ski and we're gonna stop by Aspen it's gonna be a lot of things and I think I'm gonna split this video into parts because if not, it's gonna be too long. We're staying here for 12 days. So right now we're in Durango, as I'm saying, and I'm about to leave the room because I'm always running late. My husband is always waiting for me. It's 8.39 a.m. And today we're gonna be doing a super fun thing. So we're gonna take a train, like a old train. Of course, I'm gonna show you everything. We're gonna have spectacular views and it should be a lot of fun. So yeah, guys, if you're excited for this video, please make sure you'll give a thumbs up to this video, subscribe to my channel. I'm normally uploading about fashion but from time to time I do upload my traveling videos and also this room I need to show you this room but it's gonna be later because as I'm telling you I'm running late but this room definitely deserves a room tour so yeah I'm gonna show you super quickly my outfit and I'm gonna run so I don't have a good mirror to show you the outfit but you see the um, the room already so I'm wearing a sweater this one is from forever 21 it's a zebra print sweater my jeans are from ASOS. These are my favorite jeans for a really long time. I'm wearing these combat boots from um, from uh, Mark Fisher. And it's cold outside, so I have my teddy bear coat. I love this coat. It's so, so, so warm. I bought it for this trip and yeah, it has a belt, so I'm gonna wear it belted. And I'm taking with me my Saint Laurent Sac de Jour bag. This is my newest designer bag. I have a review video on my channel. Obviously, my looks here will not be super fancy because it's cold and I don't have any special occasion to wear really fancy outfits. Everything's gonna be kind of casual, but yeah, then we will add things like this that will make it a little bit more statement. So you guys, I'm leaving now and I'll see you on the train. guys I hate this lighting so much I have to film in the bathroom because it's where I have the best lighting in this hotel terrible okay so we're back from our train experience it was fantastic it was really unique the views I mean it's something absolutely amazing so we loved it it lasts for about five hours so it's a long trip you have different tickets but we bought the ones that were around 70 80 dollars and totally worth it if you're in this area so we came back to our hotel room around 3 30 p.m something like that i took a nap because i'm on vacation <laughs> and now we're going to have dinner we are staying at a hotel called strader if you will google durango is the hotel that you will see on the images so it's located on the main street and all the restaurant shops are located on this street we're gonna go to have dinner it's gonna be like five minutes walking probably so you guys i'll see you at the dinner second day of this vlog it's tuesday what time it is 9 39 a.m and uh, we're about to leave this hotel and move to another one so 
Yesterday we just had dinner at a place called El Moro Tavern and Drinks and something like that. It was pretty good. We're actually really surprised with the amount of like good places that this town has to offer. This town is a really small place. It has only 19,000 population, but yeah, we did enjoy our stay here, but to be quite honest, the best thing that this town has to offer is obviously the train experience. Other than that, there is not much to see. Our next stop is gonna be Monument Valley. It's about three hours and a half from here, so we're gonna be driving. Uh, we rented a car with a Turo. Turo, it's an app. Uh, we rented a car of a particular, so somebody put his car on that app and we ended up renting it. And it was way cheaper and it's sometimes it's even easier. So we're gonna have a breakfast and then we're gonna go to our next dest destination. I'm just gonna show you the room of this hotel. It's called Staters. And and it's one of the most emblematic hotels in this uh, city. It has his aesthetic. It has its vibe. We definitely knew where we were coming to and we wanted to go to this hotel. We intentionally picked this hotel. So let me show you the room. So this is the room. It's like antique kitsch style. <laughs> So we have our bed that I have to say it's really small. I think it's a twin. It's not even a queen, but that's fine. And uh, this is the TV situation. This is the dresser. I actually really like the dresser. Like with this marble top and then the dresser. It's really antique. When you open it, you see how old it is. But yeah, whatever. This is the mirror. I'm going to tell the details of my outfit a little bit later. And we have this beautiful picture. Um, I wonder who this handsome man is. And we have some shelves, a desk over here, really beautiful <laughs> chairs. I'm not gonna open the window because the, um, the view is horrific, to be quite honest. And this is the bathroom. Really vintage quiche as well. So it's really small. I mean, I love this. I love this. I honestly love this. And that's the shower. So that's the room. Let me tell you the details of my outfit today. And um, I'm gonna leave because, as always, my husband is waiting for me. So I have this cardigan, this long belted cardigan on. And underneath I'm wearing a black, really simple black turtleneck. And then I have this leggings that are super cool because they are fleeced inside. And they are super, super warm. And I'm not wearing anything else. I'm just... Wearing again my Mark Fisher boots. I'm gonna wear my same teddy bear coat and my Saint Laurent sac de jour because obviously with the gray it goes perfectly. That's it for Durango. We're leaving and I'll see you in our next destination. But first, let me show you the hotel and our breakfast. <music> Monument Valley we stopped at the Four Corners Monument is where the states of Utah, New Mexico, Colorado and Arizona meet together so it's the only point in the whole United States where four different states meet together $8 per person to see this I mean it's just like a historical point and nothing really spectacular or anything like that also limit of three photos per person it's like it doesn't make sense but yeah we stopped here it was on our way so we just did it and now we'll continue with our trip <laughs>
guys so we're driving through the monument valley loop um we're staying in the hotel called the view so yeah enjoying the amazing and unique view at the monument valley We just we just checked in at the hotel the view is to die for it's absolutely breathtaking it's 4 p.m. and we didn't have lunch or anything like that so we will have lunch or dinner or really early dinner probably today was a little bit of driving and enjoying the absolutely amazing nature of Monument Valley this is absolutely something unique and if you were thinking about coming here you need to do it because you will not be disappointed that's for sure let me show you the view of our hotel room this is absolutely everything that's the trail that we did with the with our car it's 17 miles trail look we have some birds overflying beautiful and yeah, after that, we just came to the hotel. We're only staying here for one night um, because I really don't think that there is that much to do for more than one day and a half. But yeah, this is absolutely a must visit if you're in this area. Good morning, you guys. It's a new day in this vlog. What day it is? It's Wednesday and I would say it's around 9 a.m. 9.29. I'm ready to leave this hotel room. <laughs> Once again, we're moving to next hotel. We're going to the city called Glenwood. We chose that one because it's 40-45 minutes away from Aspen. And we definitely wanted to visit Aspen. We're not going to be skiing in Aspen. We're going to be skiing in Telluride in a couple of days. But first we're going to stop there. We're going to spend some time there. Relaxing a little bit. But we have five hours and a half of driving so it's gonna be just a driving day we're gonna stop in a couple of places but basically that is it so I really don't know if if I'm gonna be vlogging too much probably at night once we'll get there but yeah we woke up today and it's so gloomy and it's so foggy I wanted to take some pictures but I don't think it's gonna happen I'm gonna show you in a second how it looks outside but it's it was raining at night and where we're going it's gonna be snowing <laughs> and I'm excited about the snow but also it's like oh my gosh I don't want to be driving with snow so yeah I'm just gonna show you really quick this room it's nothing special, it's, it's three stars hotel, but the view is totally worth it. It's absolutely amazing, as I showed you yesterday. So let me show you the room, my outfit as always. We're keeping it super casual today, as always. <laughs> okay, so let me show you the room. Now let's keep moving. We're gonna have breakfast here in the hotel, and then we'll leave this beautiful place. It's a little bit dark, but you see the aesthetic. This hotel is owned by Navajo Indians, so yeah, you see the aesthetic. That's the TV, the mirror with the desk. It wasn't nothing special, but, but it's actually, it was really nice to be quite honest. So we have this rug situation and the bathroom, which is not organized. And I'm not gonna show you a lot because we have a lot of towels around and yeah, this is me. And let me show you the outside. Oh my gosh. I mean, it's still beautiful. Look at this, but it's super foggy. It wasn't that foggy yesterday. I don't have a big mirror here, so we'll need to make this work. I'm wearing all H&M. The sweater I got like two years ago or something like that. I love the color and I love, I love the neat. Wearing mom jeans, also from H&M, my favorite jeans. But we're changing the boots and we're changing the jacket, just because. So I'm wearing this boots today. 
I have only the boots that I was showing you the previous two days and these boots. These are like, the true hiking Columbia boots, but I like that they have a little bit of color, you know? I'm still gonna be wearing my YSL bag. I have another bag with me, but this is the new baby and I think it looks beautiful with everything. And I'm gonna be wearing my bucket hat. This one, I got this one from Amazon and I love it. And I'm just gonna take with me my um, black ski jacket because just to change a little bit and not wearing that teddy bear coat every single day. So yeah, I'll see you at the breakfast. Yesterday I wasn't a really good vlogger, but yesterday, to be quite honest, we didn't do much apart from driving for like six hours and then we had a delicious dinner. So, we're staying in the city of Glenwood. It's about an hour away from Aspen and Vale and we're staying here three nights. We're gonna just uh, drive around we're gonna go to aspen today and tomorrow probably we'll go to vale and to other places and today i think it's gonna be the last day of this vlog and the second part will come after yeah you guys it's 10 a.m we took it really slow today because it was snowing a lot it was snowing yesterday when we were driving and it's not fun driving with the snow especially when you're coming from california and you don't know how to drive with the snow and it was heavily snowing um, all night. I'm gonna show you a little bit around right now. We're ready to go. It's really cold, you guys. It's around 20 degrees outside, so it's cold, it's freezing. So I'm gonna show you my outfit, what I choose to wear. In the coldest day of this vlog, we're gonna have um, breakfast. There is a bunch of like cute places in this small town. It's a really small town, you have like just a street with a bunch of restaurants, coffee shops and all that kind of stuff, but it's really cute and uh, there are a bunch of good restaurants. Okay, yesterday we went to an Italian restaurant uh, called Brava, really good, delicious you guys, everything was just delicious. I ordered a pasta, my husband uh, ordered a pasta as well and we, and we had a tuna tartare as an appetizer, delicious tiramisu, really good, super recommended if you going to stay in this area. I will try to do a room tour of this hotel, but it's nothing out of this world. We booked this, this hotel a little bit late in the game and it's just functional hotel. So I'll try to film this a little bit later in the day. But let me show you what I can see outside right now. I'll show you my outfit and let's start this day. I love this, guys. I love it for a few days. I don't want to live in this weather, but for a few days, for traveling this is amazing it's so snowy it's so christmasy it's all everything i love this i have a full-length mirror for sam in this trip so i'm gonna show you i'm wearing this super cozy sweater but underneath i'm wearing another thermal like top and then i'm wearing this full leather pants in this sand color underneath i'm wearing high socks and then I'm wearing this thermal leggings as well and I'm wearing once again my Mac Fisher boots now let me put my scarf my coat and all that and I'll show you the final look and this is my final look I'm wearing my teddy bear coat my Saint Laurent bag the only bag that you saw in this video my bucket hat from Amazon and my white scarf. I don't even know where I got this one. I think I got it at Nostrum Rack. So yeah, this is the look for this really, really cold day. And I'll see you probably at the breakfast or in Aspen.
from Aspen. Uh, so we arrived around one hour ago. We just were walking around the village. We wanted to go up in the mountain, but the seaside is closed. So that's a bummer, but it's okay. So we just were walking around the village. It's just like really cute small village with lots of luxury shops, nice restaurants and all that. We had had a hot chocolate and that's it. I don't think there is that much to do here. If you're not skiing, of course, and we're not skiing here. So I think we're gonna go to Snowmass Village, which is another part of Aspen Mountains, um, where you also can ski and we'll see what we can find out there. So just gonna finish this vlog right here is the next morning of course so yesterday we spent an amazingly beautiful day in Aspen um, we went to Aspen village um, we just were walking around and then we went to snowmass ski station and they also have like a small village over there and it's super cute you guys it's really cute and uh, we weren't skiing of course but they allowing you to go up to the ski station you can have some drinks you can have some food over there and it's beautiful you guys it's a whole vibe to be quite honest so we really enjoy that and after that we just came home we stopped at another italian restaurant i think it was american italian and we had <laughs> lunch dinner like at 4 30 pm so we went here i worked for a little bit and yeah we just spent the rest of the day in our hotel room so i really hope you enjoyed this vlog if you did please make sure to give a super big thumbs up and subscribe to my channel the part two is coming right after this video and i'm actually gonna film the introduction after finishing filming the end of this video so you guys thank you so much for watching this video and i hope to see you in the next vlog Mwah. bye bye